Hello everyone, welcome to High School Mathematics channel. Today we are going to learn class 7, chapter 3, simple equations. Let us see now what is an equation. An open sentence which contains equal to sign is called an equation. Let us see what is a simple equation. An equation which involves only one variable whose highest power is 1 is known as simple equation. Solution of simple equation or root of simple equation. Let us see now. The value of the variable for which equation becomes true is called the solution or the root of the equation. See here example x plus 7 equal to 10. An equation must contain equal to sign and must have one variable having power 1. Here variable is x. Its power is 1 and here equal to sign is also present. So it is a simple equation. Solution of that simple equation is if we find the x value in this equation, that value will become the solution or root of the equation. Let us see now examples. See the first one. Convert the mathematical statements into simple equations. See the first one. 5 added to a number is 9. Let the number be x. They said 5 is added to a number. So x plus 5 is 9. That equals to 9. So the simple equation is x plus 5 equals to 9. See the second one. 4 times a number decreased by 3 is 5. Let the number be m. 4 times a number is 4m. Decrease it by 3, that means minus 3 is 5, that equals to 5. So the simple equation is 4m minus 3 equals to 5. See now third one, the sum of 3 times of n and 7 is 13. They have given number as n, 3 times of n, that is 3n, sum of 3 times of n and 7, that is 3n plus 7 is 13 that equals to 13 so the simple equation is 3n plus 7 that equals to 13 see now first question fourth sum length of rectangle is 3 meters more than its breadth and its perimeter is 24 meters let us see the solution let the breadth of a rectangle be x length of a rectangle they are given 3 meters more than its breadth that is x plus 3 Perimeter of a rectangle, we know the formula 2 into length plus breadth. That equals to 2 into length value is x plus 3. Breadth value is x. That equals to they have given perimeter as 24 meters. That is 24. That implies 2 into x plus x, 2x plus 3. That equals to 24. Now let us multiply by 2. 2 into 2x, 4x plus 2 into 3, 6. That equals to 24. Therefore, 4x plus 6 equals to 24 is the simple equation. See now question number 2. Convert simple equations into statements. See the first one. y minus 7 equal to 11. Let us see the statement. 7 is subtracted from y is 11. See the second one. 8m equals to 24. That is 8 times of m is 24. See third one now. 2x plus 13 equals to 25. 2 times x is added to 13 is 25. See now fourth one. y by 4 minus 7 equals to 1. 7 subtracted from 1 fourth of y is 1. y by 4 we have written as 1 fourth of y. So the statement is 7 subtracted from 1 fourth of y is 1. See now check your progress. Write simple equations for the following verbal statements. See the first one. The sum of 5 times of x and 3 is 28. 5 times of x is 5x. Sum of 5 times of x and 3 that is 5x plus 3 is 28. That equals to 28. So the simple equation is 5x plus 3 equals to 28. See now second one. Taking away 7 from P gives 21. Taking away means subtraction. 
So taking away 7 from P, that is P minus 7 gives 21, that equals to 21. Therefore, the simple equation is P minus 7 equals to 21. See now third one, if you add 1 third to M, then you get 25. For M, if you add 1 third, that is 1 by 3, we will get 25, that equals to 25. So, the simple equation is m plus 1 by 3 equals to 25. See now fourth one, sum of angles x, x plus 20 is a straight angle. That is x plus x plus 20 equals to, straight angle means we know that is 180 degrees. So, write up 180 degrees. Therefore, the simple equation is x plus x plus 20 equals to 180. That is x plus x, that is 2x. So, right on 2x plus 20 is equals to 180 degrees. See now fifth one. Perimeter of a rectangle whose length is 2 centimeters more than its width is 16 centimeters. Let us see the solution. Let width of a rectangle be x. Length of a rectangle is 2 more than its width. That is x plus 2. Perimeter of a rectangle, we know the formula 2 into length plus breadth. That equals to 2 into length is x plus 2. Width is x. That equals to perimeter of rectangle, they have given as 16. That implies 2 into x plus x, 2x plus 2, that equals to 16. Now, let us multiply by 2. 2 into 2x, 4x plus 2 into 2, 4, that equals to 16. Therefore, the simple equation is... 4x plus 4 that equals to 16. See now question number 2. Write the following equations in statement form. See the first one x plus 4 equals to 9. 4 is added to a number is 9. See second one 2y equals to 15. 2 times of y is 15. See third one 3m minus 3 equals to 25. 3 times a number decreased by 3 is 25. See now fourth one n by 4 equals to 5. That is one fourth of n is 5. See now example 3. Check whether the value given in the brackets is a solution to the given equation or not. 2k minus 11 equals to 5. They have given k equal to 7 value. We have to substitute this value in the given equation and find whether that value is correct solution or not. Let us see the solution. When k equal to 7, we have taken LHS that is left hand side part of given equation. That is 2k minus 11. That equals to 2 into k value is 7. Minus 11. 2 7s are 14. Minus 11. That equals to 14 minus 11 is 3. In the question, they have given RHS, that is right hand side part of the given equation is 5. Here LHS is 3 and RHS is 5. That is LHS is not equal to RHS. So, K equal to 7 is not a solution. See now example 4. Solve 6N minus 1 equal to 29 by trial and error method. Let us see the solution. Here we have taken a tabular form having columns n value LHS equal to 6n minus 1 RHS equals to 29 is LHS value is equal to RHS or not. Let us see. First we have taken 0. 6n minus 1 that equals to n value we kept here 0. So 6 into 0 is 0 minus 1. So 0 minus 1 is minus 1. But RHS value is 29. Both are not equal. So, here last column is no. Next, here n value is 1. So, n plus we substituted 1. So, 6 into 1 is 6. Minus 1. So, 6 minus 1 is 5. Here RHS value is 29. Both are not equal. So, here last column is no. Now, the n value is 2. We substituted n value equal to 2 here. So, 6 into 2, 12. Minus 1. That equals to 12 minus 1, 11. Here RHS value is 29. Both are not equal. Here last column is no. Next n value equals to 3. We substituted here. So 6 into 3. 18 minus 1. That equals to 17. But RHS value is 29. Both are not equal. So here last column is no. Now the n value is 4. So 6 into 4. 24 minus 1. That is 23. 
but RH as value is 29. Here also both are not equal, so the last column is no. Now we have taken n value equals to 5. So 6 into 5 minus 1 that equals to 6 5 is a 30 minus 1 that is 29. RHS value is 29. Here both LHS and RHS are equal. So the last column is yes. For n equal to 5, LHS is equal to RHS. So n equal to 5 is the solution of the given equation. Today we have seen chapter 3 simple equations introduction and example sums. Hope you all like this video. If you like this video, please like, share to your friends and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.